Here we are with the main man, Trevor Nelson, and it is truly a case of the apprentice has met the master today because you are a bit of a master interviewer, mate. Um, I would call me a master. Just you a chat, really, isn't it? Beyonce, Mariah Carey, Whitney Houston, Will Smith, the so, list goes on and yeah, on and on, 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 on. I mean, if you stay in the game long enough, you do get to meet them, hopefully. But, um, yeah, I've met quite a few. You have? <laughs> I've met quite a few, mate. Yeah. yeah. Uh, how long have you started? God, years. I've been in this game over 20 years. I've been doing a year now. Well, so I, I've, I've been, I'm learning off I this weren't, I weren't in it to interview, I was just in it to play records, but the thing is that, um, I suppose, when you become something in your line of work, like, my thing's R&B, yeah. so you meet the biggest stars in R&B, and that's just what happened to me. Fantastic. Yeah. You've been winning awards left, right and centre. You've got an MBE from the Queen. So that's not that's not sexy. All of this, yeah, it's not it's not <laughs> cool, I guess. It was but for it's, volunteering, but it's cool. You do a lot of charity work yeah, and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah. Uh, what are your three tips on success, Trevor? I would say stay humble. Yeah. You can have fun. But it's just fun, isn't it? You're not you're not, you're not, you're not, yeah. you're, not you're not changing the world. You're not you're not getting a, a, a some sort of Peace award, or you're not you're not saving yeah. a country. You just say, have fun, um, love what you do. You have gotta love what you do. Uh, um, I love my music. I love talking to people, um, and to get longevity because you're only a year old into this. I'm a baby. You're a baby <laughs> in this. You need to get off the nipple. I, get I'm, off the nipple. I'm on the nipple home, at the moment, and I need to work my way down. <laughs> Pay your own <What>? rent. <laughs> Be independent. Yeah. You've got to think a little bit. You know, there's only one reason certain people do really well is because they think like they don't think the same as everybody else. No. Do you know what I mean? There's got to yeah. be something about something. you that says, or that, that people like about you that they want to talk to you. Do you think successful people has got a hint of crazy in them? Definitely. Um, <laughs> I mean, with a chance that, then, I, mate. I, I, you're in with a great chance because deep down, I'm more crazy than you, but no you one knows that. No, no I want to no know, the, I wanna know another nothing, interview with this guy later. There's nothing to know. Bottom line is, I think that you've all, everyone who works in the public eye, entertains people in any way, shape or form, can't be totally normal. No. Okay, it's not possible, is it? Yes. I mean, after I do this club tonight, I'll have five minutes of a mini depression. Yeah. Because it's not depression really, but it's just a little coming sort of down. Yeah, it's like what you do straight after. You know, I used to get pissed a little bit, but you can't be doing that as you get older. There's just no need for that behaviour. Exactly. But well, I'm just saying, I used to be a bit. Of, I used to be with the boys and everything. But after a while, you've got to, you've got to change. I mean, yeah. But there is a bit of crazy in everyone, particularly musicians. And now as well, mate, it's like, I'm up in years, like, you know, and it's like uh, 42 now, mate. Actually, young, mate. I'm on the shandy. Spring. I can't drink to save my life anymore. Spring chicken. I really can't. You're spring chicken. I'm still a baby. Drink is not the thing. I know out right here, Yeah. It, it may be the thing. Yeah. But for me, like, we watched the football tonight. Did you watch it? I didn't watch the football. Okay. What He's happened? I'm a football fan. Unbelievable. Wales won. Yeah. And England conceded the goal in the last five minutes. And I said to Eddie Rocks, I will not be playing tonight if England lost. And they thought I was joking. <laughs> so that, that, that equalising goal by, um, I won't even mention the opposition then, yeah. right, by Russia, if they scored another, you wouldn't be doing this interview, it'd be over. I'd have phoned in sick. Eddie Rocks would have lost <laughs> out yeah, yeah, massively yeah. there. So every Welsh fan out there who was taking the piss before I went to watch the game, you're lucky we didn't lose because yeah. this, this club will be in revolt tonight. Well, you ain't got Gareth Bale. That's what it is, isn't it? He's not bad. He's He's got a slight bit of skill. He's not bad. He's, 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 he's up and bad. coming, yeah. isn't he? You'll yeah. get there in a few yeah. years, man. Yeah, he'll be all right. Trevor Nelson. Have you run out of things to say? No, I've are only, you, are you he's only on giving me a flipping hand. I, I yeah. can go on for hours, well, mate. You've got, you got another clinical question. Give me, give me two more questions. Two more questions you want. Mm. Did you have any fears when you started to get into DJing? Yeah, totally. What? Everything. I, I, all I did was collect music. I bought since I was 13. I used to buy music. I used to go without school dinners, dinner money, bus fare to buy music. Yeah. I used to sneak it in my house. So I love music. Yeah. I knew that, but I didn't want to be a DJ. Well, I didn't think I'd be on radio. So the first time I was on Radio 1, I absolutely shit myself. But I, did, I mean, I stayed calm. Petrified. I was petrified. And the first time I ever played at a club, my hand was just shaking holding the style, you know, the, 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 the turntable arm. I was like this. 
it is, it's scary like anything else. And even, I mean, I'm not nervous tonight. I've done a little sound check, but there's still a little bit of nerves that come into it because you're still, you're still performing it's, in some way, aren't you? It's like, because you've, you've interviewed like all these, you know, Mariah Carey, Whitney mm. Houston. Um, They're not easy, I'm Beyonce, all these They're people. They're not easy. But the reason you're a bit nervous tonight is because you're sitting next to, to me, isn't it, mate? Well, you're like, no, it's just no star power of it, mate. It's a little bit better looking. It's a little bit better looking than me. I can bit, tell you that. It's a little bit better. Definitely, it's like, it's like, I'd like to compare them. Don't even compare them to me. They're... I'm going to go with my last question. All right, go on then. Can anyone be successful? No. No? No. That's brutally honest, isn't successful, it? Successful. I mean, if you talk about media, what I'm, why I say that is I know loads of people who have got incredible talent, but the public have to like you. You yeah. can't just say, I'm a star. Someone's got to make you a star, <laughs> right? I will. So you can't keep screaming it. We're, no. in a, we're in a world that everyone says, I'm a celeb, I'm a celeb, I'm yeah. a celeb. It's not cool, though. Like your wall's full of, half of your wall is full of celebs. It's right? not my wall, it's Eddie Pe Rock's wall. People have to like. Don't bring me in the Well, mate. people have to like these people. They do like They Eddie have Ross. to like, they have, to, you know, you can't yeah. just keep saying, I want to be famous. Someone's got to like you to make you famous, you know? If you take someone like Katie Price. People loved her and hated her, but enough people loved her to make her wealthy and famous. Yeah. So with you... I, well, I'm not talking about me, I'm no, talking about I, well, them. I'm just saying, but... We, I'm saying, but achieving yeah. things. All right, I think, the, I the think girl doesn't yeah. be a celebrity. Someone yeah. wants to go for a run. I know you're a fitness guy. A little bit. A little yeah, bit not fit. as fit as you, but yeah, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do I have a little I should, pose I I've that. got potential now, haven't I? You should have blurred the camera with that bit there, mate. Everyone's like, I mean. you ain't got no arms, bro. I've got no chest either. Blur it out. Blur it out. Blur it out. Yeah. Um, that, yeah, I think that's it. I, we're going to wrap up, aren't we? I don't right. want to wrap up, it's mate. I want to interview you again it's sometime in London. It's a pleasure. Trevor Nelson. I'm an interviewer. A, you don't need to interview an it's interviewer. Been an, I do, mate. I was, under, I was under huge pressure tonight. <laughs> Trevor Nelson, it's been an absolute Thank honour you. and a pleasure. Thank you so Thanks much. Thanks for watching, guys. Have an awesome week.